Oh, what's this? Look at this, look at this. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> well, come over all golf. It's like a left back through time. Maybe not such a big leap, but... Uh, <laughs> is that the wailing of a banshee? Go, girl. Woo! <laughs> Is that the wailing of a banshee? Woo! Woo! That can only mean one thing. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it's the High Priestess of Punk. The one, the only, Susie Sue is here! in the word pussy. Um, <laughs> no, because I'm always asking you to come on, and you're always away. You I'm always at home in France with my three pussies. Outside, to, outside <laughs> Toulouse. Outside Toulouse, no time to lose. No. And you've never asked me whilst I'm in town. And finally, joy of joys, it's all happened at the same time. Yes. No, you know, I remember spending happy, I'm pretty bored with this, I spent many <laughs> happy summers outside Toulouse in Lille Jordan. Uh-huh. Yes. Well, yeah. Lost my virginity in a tent outside of Lujan. Anyway, uh, <laughs> but enough about me. Uh, now, the thing is, basically, now, I, it is, I didn't understand that Susie and the Banshees, right, they were at the beginning of it all. I mean, really, at kind of the beginning. 1976. Of... Whoa. 76, yeah, we were but talking then, about But then, kind of, punk went away and everything. But you didn't split up till 1995? 1995, yes. Well, the, the spirit was there. The bloody hell it was. <laughs> but, and now, couldn't stay away, you're, seven years later, you're back for the Seven Year Itch Tour. Yes. And that's 5th, 6th, 9th, 10th of July in Glasgow, Sheffield, uh, Shepherd's Bush, and the Best of the Banshees album is coming out as well? Finally, yes, in September, October. I think we spent the best part of seven years um, rowing with Polydor. <laughs> Because <laughs> <laughs> was your was your image like was it kind of deliberately out to shock? Uh, I suppose I suppose so. Yes. But yes. We're having fun with it. Yeah. No. God. Absolutely. Yeah, I mean. I mean. Because yeah. some some of the pictures are. are oh, you do you do kind of think mm, out to shock at all, and then you see a picture like that with one leather <laughs> boot and a swastika on your arm. And you go, mm, quite out that there. That was on my way to the shops. <laughs> <laughs> Was that man getting milk out of the fridge uh, for you? Uh, <laughs> yes, yes. Now, earlier, you were talking about cats and, yes. and loving cats. Where are my kittens? Sorry? I was told you were going to supply kittens to make me feel at home. What, are you Mariah Carey? What? <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer Lopez, suddenly. Just Where are my kittens? kittens? <laughs> this must be backstage. Oh, I'm terrible. No, I do. Well, Just the, the fondle. Well, the closest <laughs> I can do, the closest I can do, someone did send me um, a, oh, a book. A book. Oh. This is weird. This is my continuing quest for knitting. People uh, know that I, I don't even like knitting. I don't know why. But anyway, they sent me this. It's a lovely book of knitted cats. <laughs> Now, if Satan had knitting needles... <laughs> no, they're vile, these things. Look at them. They're just horrible. Like, look at those cats. There's just something wrong. Look at that. <laughs> look, at that. Look, at that. look at that one down there. That's it. That should have been put down. <laughs> it's just... Uh, it's so weird, but they, you should've got to knit a cat. should be cute. Evil. Evil. I, 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 there's something about the shape of a cat. That no matter what it's made of, it looks good. I think you yeah, love them. I, I really have got a thing about them. Oh, well, because I knew you loved cats, so I've also yeah. got a couple of little uh, MPEGs of cats. You know the little film? You've probably seen these. If you love cats, we've probably sent these to you. Uh, where am I? There's this one. This is Sumo Cat, right? This is a sort of David and Goliath of the cat world. I will. I will. Oh, yeah, I, I have to, seen this. I'm going to yes. do something very bad to you. I'm yeah. going to hit you. I'm going to beat you. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> And we oh. cut away there just before he kills it. And, uh, <laughs> not really. And then this one, this one's just, I find it very cute. Uh, here we go. So I'm walking through the garden, having a very nice time in the garden. Uh, where's the cat? Oh, there's the cat! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we love 
seen that one. I'll email it to you. It'll have it to keep forever. Thank you. Show it to your cat. Um, now, also, uh, all this week, we've been looking at uh, kind of uh, sad home pages. You know, sort of variety of uh, things that we've stumbled across where people, you know, just they're a bit sad. Mm. And uh, we stumbled across this man, who I think you might find quite interesting. Uh, his name is Curtis Curtis Nichols. And there's Curtis. He's a songwriter. Uh, new wave, punk, he loves it all, and he likes Marilyn Manson, Skinny Puppy, Iggy Pop, there you go, Susie and the Banshee, Nine Inch Nails, blah, blah, blah. A songwriter, he's burnt a CD, um, and includes songs such as Commit Me No. Uh, I think that should be Commit Me Now, but he <laughs> spells it tragically. Uh, Kmart, bloody, 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 bloody Sunday. Uh, you slammed a stake in me, and a uh, song for mother. Uh, <laughs> But anyway, he's got, he's got a, a CD. If anyone in the music business uh, would like to hear my songs, email me. I went very squeaky there, didn't e I? E email me. Email me. Well, we emailed him. And uh, so he's expecting me to call. He's very excited because, you know what I mean, I don't think many people email him. So uh, <laughs> we can uh, have a chat with Curtis. Oh, there we go. Uh, Oh, hello. Is, is that Curtis? Uh-huh. Oh, hello, Curtis. It's um, uh, Graham Norton here. I've been emailing, me, emailing you from Britain. Hey. Hello. Hi. Um, and, uh, I, I mean, I work in television myself, but uh, I, I was kind of uh, in, intrigued by your whole music. And uh, tonight I, I have someone that I think could help you and give you advice. Uh -huh. uh, uh, they work in the music industry. Cool. Yeah, but more than that, uh, they just don't work in the music. It's someone you really like. It's Susie Sue. No way. <laughs> no way. Don't, she, don't lose your cool now, Curtis. Is she, the, is she there? Yeah, no, she's here. She's here. Woo. Uh, uh, Hello. That was hey. Susie Sue. Oh, do you want to hold a bit of pipe? Yes. Oh. Is, Hello? Is, Hello, can you hear me? Hey. Where are you? Uh, uh, what? Where, not, not in what room, what, what town are you in? I'm in uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Oh, right. Well, the, the Banshees were over there in April, but not there. Oh, uh, oh, damn. Even, damn. I, Susie, even I didn't understand that. <laughs> we were there, but not there. <laughs> now, listen, um, uh, so do you, do you have a bit of your CD, or can you, can you no, let well, us hear? Actually, if I was just practicing, um, I just could just play, play you right now. All right, uh, what, are, what are you going to play for us? Um, well, I got a few songs. I got this one song called Kmart. Okay, do you want to play a little bit of Kmart? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Hold on. Hold on. Can you hear that? Yep. There's a side that makes my skin just crawl. Taste, Curtis was a bit angry. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have anything, anything a bit nicer, like song, uh, what about song for mother? Sounds uh, nice. Oh, you want to hear a song for mother? I'd like to hear a song for mother. Uh, nice. Um, I mean, all right, okay, okay. Okay, here we go. Fine. Song for mother. Hold on, hold on. Okay. You give birth to me. <laughs> you give birth to me. Thank you.